You two are bad friends. Who are these two idiots? A white dude and an Asian dude. You two are disgusting. Well, you two are something. We're bad friends. Did you bring anything to the cookout? That's today. <laughs> oh my god. No, is that today? Yes, Rudy, did you bring something to the cookout? Andres? You fucking called me. Yeah, because you're doing the show. Did you bring anything for the you cookout? You told me to bring something for the cookout. You, you were don't... supposed to bring something for the cookout. Did you... Wait, wait. Wait, wait, wait. Hold on. Hold no, on. no, don't no. point at the guys. Because wait, oh, you... wait, wait, what are those guys? What are they doing, though? They're ashamed that you didn't bring something to the cookout. Yeah, but why didn't they remind me to bring... Andreas, why didn't you invi uh, remind me to bring something to the cookout? <laughs> because we recorded three days ago. Yeah, I knew you wouldn't. You, you know that I wouldn't? Yeah. Yeah, we knew you wouldn't do shit. You know I would do it? <laughs> what scumbag. a fucking piece of shit you are. Dude. No, no, no. You. Don't no, pass man. the buck to him. Yeah? You're a scumbag. You yeah. didn't bring shit to the cookout. All right, Juliana? And we did. I, I thought Andreas would text you. Yeah, yeah. Did he text you? <laughs> yeah. So you reminded her? Yeah, I can trust her. And you didn't remind me? Yeah. Okay. Bring me my potato salad. <laughs> so hey, Bobby hey, reminded hey, me hey, yesterday. Hey, 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 Bro, it's right there. Bro, what the fuck? You told me to bring potato salad. No, I told you to come to the fucking headphones. show at and tomorrow. Bring tomorrow, but you also told me yesterday to bring the potato salad. That's why I brought that he shit. He brought the potato salad. No, I never thought I said to you bring You told it. me that yesterday. That's the only reason I bought it. I didn't even know I had to bring anything because you told me that when you said do the show See? tomorrow. Now, here's what we're going to have to do. Okay. Here's what we're going to have to do. Why are you talking to me in that tone? <laughs> I like it. I like it. No, no, but why are you talking to me in that tone? Because you be bullshit. You know what I mean? <laughs> First of all, oh. I called you yesterday to do the show tomorrow night, right? Yeah. And you're like, ah, oh, nah, nah, I don't do the store. That was crazy. No, it wasn't. Why? Because you already know. We have this discussion <laughs> on how I feel about the store. Yeah, but this is so, not the I... store. It's not, it's, a, it's not a store sponsored thing. It, you're part of the Bad Friends family. But once... We're doing a Bad Friends show at the comedy store. And that's what I invited to you to. Once I realized that, I said, okay. Right? Uh, yeah, yeah. All okay. right. I, okay. He, he, did you drink today? A little bit. Okay. <laughs> I can tell. <laughs> I can tell. I can all tell. Right. He gets mouthy. So he first of all, yeah, yeah. welcome to the cookout. Welcome to the cookout. Rudy, do you want to explain what you brought? What is this? I brought a sponge cake that is very famous in the Philippines. It's called mamon. 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 Or we call it torta sometimes. Oh no, torta's uh, Mexican. Yeah, Mexican. That's yeah. not yours. You can't just have that. <laughs> Wait, so is this it? Yeah. This says ube and sinam and samada. Ube and samada. Yeah. yeah. Is this good? Does it need to be heated up? No. Yeah. Is that cheese on top? Yeah. yeah. All right. They have cheese too down there. All right. So so oh, it's really soft. So, yeah, yeah. So do we all have to try this? Yeah. yeah. I've already had a couple, so um, I'm I'm past. And now what's inside of this? As I get grossed out, what is yeah. that purple stuff that's in there? It's just cream. Purple cream? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Just try slow, it. Look at okay. him. Okay, wait a minute. Excited. You want to try one of these ube and sanambas? Yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. All right, and, and this is all, the whole bag is filled with this, right? Yeah. It's just one thing. Do you guys want to try one? I'm good. Here, Pete, yeah. let's see if we can do yeah. this without knocking anything over. Yeah. Perfect. Good catch, Pete. Thank you. Um. All right, so let me try one. Let's try a little bit of ube and sanamba because we want to try everybody's everything that we brought to the, mm -hmm. to the cookout here. What do you need, uh, yeah, Doc? Yeah. I'm gonna grab this for Worry about me, fellas. Uh, mouthy. There Whoa. You mouthy. Good. Man, shut your punk ass. All right, I'm ready. So what? What is? He has hostility toward me. This is good. It's good, right? It's not hostility. You know why he's? Ho you know he's hostile. Why? He just got out of jail. He stormed the stage at Dave Chappelle. <laughs> <laughs> was that you, Doc? Fucking no. Yeah, yeah. Was, it looked like yeah. you. I was like, fuck. <laughs> Dude, they beat the shit out of that guy oh good mm. did you see the pictures of this guy no bring up the photo of this guy look at the guy that stormed the this fucking guy you know what happened after it was over yeah. they gave him a couple more <laughs> you know yeah, they yeah. gave him a couple more knocks. i don't know exactly what happened i just know that he was assaulted he storms the stage oh, oh. Yeah, and yeah, yeah. that's him that, the clearest one is like the yeah. fifth one down do you see it here i got it right here oh you do yeah oh my god okay <laughs> And why did Zoom he do it? Why did he face? do it? Why did he do it? Well, I don't know motive yet. Oh, but apparently somebody said he had Oh shit, you don't. <laughs> a Bobby Lee show assault. assault. Nothing will happen. Assault. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Attack Bobby because at his show, it'll just give you a hug. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. But got this guy this got guy. caught oh, up in the Matrix. Fuck. What's that called in black culture when that happens to this guy, Doc? 
beat down. Getting beat down. <laughs> got beat down. You huh? getting Hell beat yeah. the fuck down. Got fucked. Yeah. Down. Well, here's here's the deal. So he tackles Dave, mm. and apparently he's got like a knife and or a, something that looks like a gun or a knife. I I can't. I don't know the details. Mm. And Dave got out of the way. Ju- good timing on Dave. Dodged. He used just your technique of dodging elephants. It yeah, was yeah, really yeah. Good. Look at that's what it is. It was a <laughs> knife that looked like a gun. You think he'll PTSD from it? Dave? Yeah. No. Oh. No. Because he. Fu- they it f- seems traumatic, though. It looks like he yeah. won. Do you know what I mean? I know, but still. <laughs> I, I, okay, he did win. Do you know what I mean? I understand that. It just feels like Dave is like. I, I don't know. Maybe the, his security will get tighter. No one will be able to access the stage, period, now. Yeah. Like, how. I it just I just don't understand how. Because I've like been to like a Cure concert. And like, how do I get up there to attack Robert Smith? <laughs> I wouldn't, don't but I'm just saying, how would you even be able to do it? I mean, you see the Hollywood Bowl you've been, you can walk right up to the stage. Yeah. Oh, I, mean, I see. I think, I think what you can do is, <laughs> we're giving tips on how to do this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What is this that you brought, Pete? Is this a burrito? This is uh, sausage and pepper, salsicci pepperu. It's an Italian cookout. Oh, oh my God. Oh this my guy brought God. an entire sausage and pep? He probably That's made right. it at home, too. Look Dude, at let me tell you something about sausage and pep. Oh, it's nice and sticky. <laughs> Whoa, Bobby, you've never had sausage and peppers, have you? No, never. You don't know nothing about what it. What is a pep there? Italiano, the sausage, sausage and pep. Oh. This is so good, Pete. Where'd you get this from? Uh, Italian market. Uh, it's called Mario's. Do me a huge favor. I'm not kidding. Yeah. Take a bite of this. You're going to fucking lose your mind. Yeah, but I had a meatball sandwich. for lunch. I'll eat some. <laughs> but you got to. All right. You got to. Mm-hmm. How good is that? Mamma mia! Mamma yeah. mia! Bada boom, bada bing! Bada bing, bada boom! That's you looking it? at me? Come on, T. <laughs> hey, T, this guy's over here talking shit. <laughs> you gonna let him talk to you like wow, that? Wow, that's great. You never watched The Sopranos, did you? Hello? <laughs> yeah? Can I have a napkin? Yeah. And the last thing we need to have you eat at the cookout is the potato salad and the kimchi and that. You gotta try all of it. Okay. Why me, though? <laughs> nah, because you didn't bring anything. <laughs> I brought the fucking potato salad! <laughs> Who brought the potato salad? Was it Rudy? On the way over here, where did we go? Ralph's. Who, yeah. Who brought? Whose idea was it though? To Bobby's. To pick it up and buy it? Yeah. Don't do that. <laughs> <laughs> Don't do that because you know he didn't bring it. Can I have one of those? Pete? I did bring it. I, what an uh, what an unbelievable waste of food. I hope we don't air in a country where they're struggling to get food. <laughs> what, what, you do. You mean what? I hope <laughs> none of our fans are in countries where they can't <laughs> get food. <laughs> well, I, I looked it up. And Ethiopia is. Are we are good? Huge. Oh, huge. We're huge in Ethiopia? Yeah, huge in Ethiopia. It's yeah. good to know we got fans. <laughs> yeah, yeah. No, yeah. So, listen. Here's the bottom line. Bob, hmm. you brought your salad. Yeah. And he brought his. Yeah. But the problem was, uh-huh. we wanted it homemade. Because you said, black people and potato salad, we make the best and we care about which one, where it comes from. This is just Vons. Yeah, I get it. But, but why did we, I wanted you to bring your potato salad. What do you want me to? I don't have a fucking kitchen in my studio. If I would have had one, I would have fucking made one. I mean, what the fuck? Stop, stop, stop. Wait a minute. Wait, wait. Let me ask you something. How's that my problem? Let's talk about Let's talk about it. Right. Can I ask you some questions? Oh, go ahead. Shoot. And I'm not assaulting you, and I'm not going to make fun of you at all. What you do? And say it. Let's go to basics. Yeah, let's go. Do you have a bathroom? Yes. Okay, with a shower and everything. So you shower. can make wine in the toilet. Shower, but not a bathtub. <laughs> you don't have a bathtub, but you have a shower. No. Yeah, yeah. But you don't. You no, don't, I don't have a bathtub. But, but you don't. You don't take baths, do you, Doug? No, a shower. Yeah. But if you had a bathtub, you would take a bath. No. <laughs> you don't it's like disgusting. baths. No, oh, I love that. Because when you wash yourself down and all that nut juice and all that sitting in there, it's like a fucking. <laughs> okay, oh, can I you know? say something right now? <laughs> what the right? fuck are you talking about? What the about? fuck are you talking about? <laughs> I don't know how much hey. nut juice comes out of your nut. <laughs> right? Right? Obviously, a ton. A ton, right? Yeah. right? Yeah. It must be just a faucet of fucking nudges. <laughs> <laughs> like there's a knob and <laughs> of nudges. Now listen, okay. Black uh, nut juice. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Black nut juice. What you do is this. I don't plug in the fucking thing at first. What I do is I let the faucet run in the bath. Mm-hmm. I stick my asshole to it. Mm-hmm. And I take pine tar soap. Mm-hmm. That's what I use, right? And I stick the bar inside the asshole and I, <laughs> and I, and I wash it out. Right? Yeah. Then my nut juice, I squirt out some in the little fucking closet. Yeah, little, you know, I don't have as much as you do. <laughs> I have like three little squirts. You know what I mean? Yeah. Nut juice, nut juice, nut juice, right? Then mm-hmm. I wash out my dick, right? right? And then I plug it up. So all the nut juice and shit juice is all in the drain, baby. All in the drain. Yeah. And then I put hot water in. Mm-hmm. I put some Epsom salt. 
right? Mm, and I, I take a little it. bath. Yeah. And it's relaxing. You ever bath bomb? You so ever take one of those I do, baths? Yeah, sometimes I'll go to like uh, Lush. Oh, I love it. Like, don't you love Lush? Oh, I love it. The, the <laughs> rainbow ones where it makes all the colors. Oh, bubble up on me bath yeah, bomb. Like it's like, did Ellen John, John fart in here? <laughs> <laughs> you know I thought you said Ellen at first. Yeah. Yeah. That would also well, work. Well, the joke <laughs> would have been better if I would have said it right. Did Ellen yeah. John fart in yeah. here? Yeah, I fucked up the joke. That's Elton John and Ellen together. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ellen John. Did Ellen John fart in here. No. Do you take baths, Rudy? No, I don't like it. Why? Because you? Because it was like a? Was it an evil thing back in the Philippines? No, I just can't rest. <laughs> don't you rest in the bath? What? What? Don't you rest? That's what white people do. Yeah, we just hang out. <laughs> yeah. I can't do that. What do you mean whites do it? He does it too. Um, yeah. Maybe just him. You think it's only a white thing? That's what I see in TVs. What were the showers like in the Philippines? Um, Did they time you? There's no shower. You just have a tub. A bucket. Yeah, and then you just do that. Relax. relax. Is that relaxing? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, too relaxing. Yeah. But yeah, you yeah. got to get through it before the water gets cold. Yeah. There's no hot water. It's oh, that's just really cool. cold. Do you boil it? No. No, no there's it's just no. all cold. Yeah. Is the water, where's the water from? The river? <laughs> we have a tank. There's you have a, a tank. tank, yeah. A well? No, a tank. A t so it's a water tank. Yeah. They put the, they put the river water <laughs> in the water tank, right? It's yeah. clean. It's clean. It's well, where's clean. the water from the, I'm not making fun of you. I don't know, but I see like trucks and they just put water in the ah, tanks. Ah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. It's the same trucks that uses the porta potties and they drain those. <laughs> so y'all use cold water. Yeah. What? Water. So you got a good immune system then. Uh, yeah. Because, you know, because, you know, when you take a cold shower. Here we go. This is black doctor, magic. Oh, doctor, doctor, doctor. Doctor. This is old black, yeah, this is old black magic. Spit. Right. Oh, man, when you, take, when you take a cold shower, <laughs> you ain't going to get COVID. No. <laughs> By the way, this motherfucker got COVID like three times. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 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 cold showers. Yeah. I need to take cold showers. You still should start. So when you take cold showers, what happens is your body gets cold, break it down, and then your fucking blood gets the fucking, you know. Can I, I have a theory, though. I know. Well, I know. Like cold baths are really good for you. you have to work out so for your I, muscles. I go to the when I go to the Korean spa. I'll go to the. It may heighten your immune system. Get may, it? Yeah, smoking may kill you. Oh well, then you might well, as well. Well, what say the fuck? Who the fuck? Then. I can say may so, to anything. So the doctor said. No, you may be bad. six feet okay. tall. <laughs> no, no, no. Most no, likely I'm not. not may. I am not. <laughs> yeah, you are not. You yeah. am not. Well, I, 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 I have a theory that going to the hot sauna and then going into the cold plunge and going back and back and forth will elevate my life extend well they do say do like doing that is good it tricks your body so it is good for you like you have you ever done um cryotherapy no what's that <gasps> give me, give me can me. we go yeah i'll do cryo cryo is amazing i mean you basically are in like a freezing tank you're standing up in like a it, it, it uses um look at that there's cryo right there look at that negative 243 fuck wow does it build? Is it lukewarm and then it builds to no, cold, it or is it cold up front? No, it's freezing I fucking cold. Fucking outer space is minus two seventy five. That's fucking fucking shit. Yeah. Well, you got to wear gloves and stuff, and you got to protect yourself, otherwise you'll get frostbite and die. Yeah. And you can only be in there for I don't even know. It's a, it's really quick. Did you know in two thousand twenty nine, two thousand twenty eight, or twenty twenty nine, there's going to be space resorts? Yeah. Don't get him. Now you're getting him started on NASA shit. Yeah, 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 yeah. So there's going to be space resorts, and I might book a weekend there how much is it i don't know how much it's gonna be but um that's a what i heard space Dude, resort you can go to space yeah there's a resort in, like a hotel in, in space. seven years yeah fuck the flight alone is world's like first space hotel will open in 2027 grand. yeah look at that that's... do you want to go in on a vacation home let's 50 50 <laughs> yeah i'm so down we yeah. have a timeshare can i go no no you're not going <laughs> why not you're so skinny you float away into yeah. the fucking abyss <laughs> <laughs> I want to see We're, space. Nah. Yeah, look look up. at the sky. Yeah, at look at night. Up. Okay. That's space. You're yeah. in space right now. Yeah. Space tourism is no longer uh, stuff of the science fiction. We're just around the corner. Aside from private mission, missions, uh, this says uh, it's going to have 2027. Yeah. Wow. So where is it? Mars? Got to be Mars. No. It's just, uh, it just probably uh, uh, floating. Our atmosphere. Just floating? Yeah. It just no, uh, like not wanna, that far from Earth. Take mm -hmm. me to a planet or fuck off. I want to go to another planet. Can we start with just floating in space and then we'll go to other planets? I don't want to. I want to go right to the thing. Yeah. I wanted to go right to the best ride. When we went to fucking Six Flags, what did we do? Did we start off with some bullshit? Or did no. we do the fucking... X2. We yeah. did X2 We did X2 right off the bat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Why, am I fuck Why would I want to go toy around it? Just take me to the fucking planet. I gave her a scenario. That I remember we were, we were driving and I go, if there was a planet, right, that had the same, you know, atmospheric conditions that Earth did, mm -hmm. right, 
but we didn't, knew nothing about it. Would you just move there forever? Mm-hmm. And she said yes. I would I, immediately. What? That, uh, that's insane. What else do I have to live for down here? Your wife? Oh. <laughs> like I can't get a new fucking wife in space? <laughs> space pussy? No. <laughs> you don't know what Andrew. space... Andrew, yeah, yeah. great to meet you. I've been waiting for you. I have 75 vaginas. You Ooh. can fuck all of them. Imagine. Yeah. Imagine. You Are don't know what they got. Are they all good, though? No, there's, no. <laughs> there's got to be a couple of damaged ones. Two of them bite your dick off. It's like Russian, <laughs> hey. it's like Russian roulette. What, what if two of them are like real nice, though? Yeah, but you got to find them. Yeah, yeah. The Kepler data calculated the Milky Way could harbor as many as 6 billion Earth-like planets. Well, another estimated the number of potentially habitable planets in our galaxy, about 300 million. You're telling me you wouldn't take the opportunity to go live on another planet knowing because, number, you, could, well, you, you would survive. Okay, you're not going to die right away. Yeah, you could because we don't know what the kind of viruses are on, on, on the planet. No, no, no. But you just did say it was the same atmosphere as here so we can breathe just fine. There's no, it water has oxygen. And water. Right? And water, but we don't know what viruses. There's probably new viruses there. Very good. What? He's right. <laughs> you never for know what? what the fucking for hell what? Fuck agree yeah. with me now, thank you so much fucking... now do you regret though now he's on your side <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Feel good. No. Well, in a okay. debate team I, w- I would be scared yeah. but like, yeah, you yeah, shouldn't yeah. be Bobby that's some good shit I'm let me tell you something yeah. I don't give a fuck what viruses exist up or there or creatures we don't know what kind of creatures live there you'll be embedded in history forever for being one of the first people yeah. to go try it I, I would rather be that but let me ask you this than question than fucking die just doing this podcast but you have to bring six people what six would you bring you why? I could use you as a shield. <laughs> <laughs> I just feel like I would be the experimental guy. Yeah, 100%. go in the cave. Go in the cave. No, Bob, come on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. just go down. Yeah, and I go in the cave, and I'm dead. Well, we can't go in that cave. <laughs> yeah. I would bring. I would bring Griff, Eric Griffin. Why? <laughs> oh, I know why. Why? Food sampling. <laughs> he would eat anything. Taste that. <laughs> <laughs> he eats it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. His head explodes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can't eat so that. So we got to bring Griffin. Then you have to bring a sacrificial lamb. You know what that is, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, if the, if the creatures are like, you know, we need one of you, <laughs> and then we'll let you go free. Who do I bring? <laughs> I'll do it. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, you're going yeah, yeah. in. Yeah. See, that's what's disgusting. Yeah. <laughs> she loves it. Yeah. She thinks it's going to be some kind of alien orgy. That's why she wants to go. Yeah. She, she nods it off. Would you bring Doc? For science. We need the science guy. <laughs> he hesitated. <That> <laughs> no, no, no. I'll br- I would bring you, but you, I, you'd have to shut the fuck up about the space because I would. He'd be sitting there all, all day. Yeah. No, you know, I was reading this. I was reading the Pentagon report for the CIA. <laughs> yeah. you know, these little rocks. And I he'd know, go right. on and on and and like you'd be, you'd be exhausted. And then another thing he would be doing is he'd drift away, right? And he'd try to pick up like berries, mm-hmm. and then he'd like like build like some like. Wood apparatus. Uh-huh, what are you food. doing? I'm making wine. Yeah, you know, yeah. <laughs> uh, you'd be, you'd be, uh, wine. be looking to get oh, fucked yeah, up. You'd be getting fucked up because we wouldn't allow the wine, but you would. Puck... Yeah, go ahead. Okay, let me ask you this: <laughs> What if it was Survivor style though? You dropped off at that planet. You still would do it, and and if what? dinosaurs, dinosaurs are still <laughs> dinosaurs, you know are the still dinosaurs, species, right? right? <laughs> we can buy dinosaur claws. Yeah, yeah. And they sell dinosaurs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But if dinosaurs were still roaming that particular planet, I love those. Would you still do it? Yeah. No, that's. But you've added What's too many. Does? You've added too many shaky elements. Well, you didn't say. Oh, you're, what you're saying is is that we get captured and we get dropped off there as some sort of experiment. There it is. <laughs> that's what I'm talking about. All right. So good. what you're saying is that if well, can, we can't choose who we get dropped off with, then do we? You can still. Oh, so whatever the, makes you come. So the alien comes down and goes, "We're gonna capture you, but you get to choose the five that you get captured with." Or no, I thought I think they would just randomly. They're very diplomatic like that. Yeah. Okay. okay I didn't oh, know really? That. I didn't know that. I didn't know that. <laughs> yeah. L- let me say this: All right. if dinosaurs were on any of these places, yeah. I would never go. Okay. There, yeah, you, yeah. You, you, you're done. Okay. You're absolutely fucking. If it weren't for the asteroid that killed those fucking things, we wouldn't exist. The only reason I think that happened universally is to save human race or, you know, whatever we came from to eventually get us to be this point because dinosaurs were going to roam well, this thing for way long. Dinosaurs were created by the devil to make us think that there were dinosaurs, okay? Can you believe that, Shane? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Because the Earth has only been around for like 3,000 or 5,000 years. So just, just a little bit longer than we've been here? Yeah, yeah. Hmm, seems weird. Yeah. Don't we have proof that there's fucking... 10,000 year old. Deviled, it's all the devil. Oh, deviled. it's fake. Yeah, yeah. To trick us. Huh. To not to believe in the Bible. Well, yeah. I got di- I like this devil. <laughs> <laughs> to not believe in the yeah. Bible. Hello, Tushy! 
You guys, um, <laughs> my, honestly, um, I've always had a dirty butthole. Since I've known you. Yeah, since you've known me. But yeah. no, but since you've known me, because in our old studio and this studio, we have the tushy. We got that tush. Our, my butthole is clean as a whistle, buddy. Um, I could eat off of it. You guys, honestly, it's like a game changer for your life. The time for spring cleaning is upon us. Do more than just dust your cabinets and organize your closets. Yeah. Spling, spling, spring clean your butthole <laughs> with Hello Tushy bidets. That's After right. wiping with dry, scratchy toilet paper all winter long, our bums could use a serious refresh. Put your cl cleanest booty forward and start washing the w with the Hello Tushy. Let me tell you something. <laughs> Love the Tushy because it's better for the environment. Uh -huh. All right. And also, you get way cleaner, yeah. right? You don't have that weird, uncomfortable moment where you got some swass when you get sweaty ass, and then you can feel maybe there's a little bit of leftover down mm, there. Mm. I don't like that. And this one washes your bum with fresh water, way better clean the toilet paper. Yeah. You simply spray it, pat it dry, it attaches to your existing toilet, no electrician or plumber needed. You can do it at home, because me and this idiot did it. Mm. You can do it in less than eight minutes. Cut down your and your TP use by 80%, okay? What about so you, Jules? What do you have to say? Hello Tushy has cleaned over 1 million happy bums. Join them and take care of your business the cleaner way. We want all of our listeners to have clean bums. Yeah. Visit hellotushy.com slash badfriends to get 10% off plus free shipping right now. Tag us and at Hello Tushy on social media so we can celebrate your clean butt with you. That's hellotushy.com slash badfriends for 10% off. Better help. help. Hey, life can be very overwhelming. You Many people tell me that again. are burnt out, you know, and bummed without even knowing it. You can be Hello. Motiv without motivation. You can feel helpless or trapped, detachment, fatigue, and so much more. And these are all signs but, that you may need to get a little bit of online therapy. But I have therapy. a solution. You got better one? Help, dude, because I've been using BetterHelp. Mm -hmm. And it's, it's you know, all the, 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 the sadness and the trauma and all that. It's been relieved. I feel free as a little a fly baby. A little fly baby? Yeah, baby yeah, yeah. Boy? We associate burnout with work, but that's not the only cause. Any of our roles in life can lead us to feel burned out, and BetterHelp Online Therapy wants to remind you to prioritize yourself. Talking with someone can help you figure out that what's causing stress in your life. Yep, so look, Bob and I both talked about this. Uh, we use it, I do love it. I do think that perhaps uh, online therapy might be right for you. You don't have to go to a weird office. You can stay at home, which Bob loves. Mm -hmm. It's customized online therapy from BetterHelp that offers video and phone, even live chat sessions with your therapist. You don't have to turn on your camera if you don't want to. And it's much more affordable than in-person therapy. And you can be matched with a therapist in under 48 hours. What about you, Jules? How can they get the deal, Jules? Bad friends listeners get 10% off their first month at betterhelp.com slash bad friends. That's better, H-E-L-P dot com slash bad friends. Zombie apocalypse, though, right? I would definitely bring you. Now, why is that? Because you're small. Okay. Low to the ground. You're low to the ground. Low you can get us stuff. Mm -hmm. okay. Yeah, go to the fucking Gelson's, man. Bobby, you're only an inch taller than me, but go ahead. Fuck yeah, but that inch guy. is a dead giveaway. It's a dead giveaway. <laughs> they see him. That <laughs> yellow beanie, they're going to see for miles. <laughs> yeah, I always wear my beanie. You ain't even... And yeah. at night, we can just, you know, yeah. let you go. <laughs> And you can just scramble on the earth down to wherever you need to go, grab stuff, and then come right back. I imagine Doc is a zombie. We would just ah, let him in. Let him in. He's not scary at all. <laughs> he's just what a, is he gonna do? He's <laughs> just drunk. <laughs> yeah, he's a, a drunk. drunk zombie. <laughs> yeah. Oh, come on, back. I'll tell him. <laughs> just taking a nap. <laughs> <laughs> you. <look. laughs> I still have my. Do, do a Doc. Do a Doc zombie impression. Okay. <laughs> do the combo, all right. <laughs> you gotta, you gotta try. Okay. Oh. <laughs> you gotta, oh. Oh, 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 come on, man! <laughs> <laughs> That's fucking good. Yeah, yeah, I really like good. That. Oh, 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 <laughs> That's like, that was like oh, 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 Tino, Tino. <laughs> come on, Bobby man. Yeah. Look, I want to say this before we continue on with the fun. This, what is this called again? Mamun. Mamun. Sh this stuff's fucking good. Yeah. yeah. Shout out to Mamun. Okay. Yeah. You like the Italian sub. Mm -hmm. Pretty good. Uh, you don't want to break into the potato salad, do you? Well, I brought my own. So I'm going to try my, some of mine. So Doc says mm -hmm. that there's, is there a ranking system to potato salad? Yeah. Really? Well, it depends on your I want your you to try notes. both of these and tell me which one is better. Well, why don't we do this? Is. You guys put two on a plate. Oh, yeah. Mix it about. Yeah. And see which one's better. Mm -hmm. And see which one he so says go, is be, better. Go over there behind, you know, so... This one's Doc. This one's mine. Okay. That's so good. This is so fun. This is it's like fun. the Pepsi challenge. Yeah, yeah, Remember yeah, that? Fun, yeah. When they're like, this one's way better. I'm a Coke fan. <laughs> they're like, no, nah, it was Pepsi. Yeah. 
I never believed that. I thought it was o- it was always the other one anyway. Or they put Pepsi in both, and I was like, this is a fucking scam. Another thing I asked um, this Juliana was in the car ride over. I said, what drugs have you tried? She goes, I, I haven't tried any drugs except for weed. Yeah. And then I go, um, if Harry Styles was shooting heroin. <laughs> oh, come on. Would you shoot heroin with him? And she said, yes. What? Are you serious? You would do that? But that's never going to happen. Who the fuck knows? This show is getting popular. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I don't know. Do you, you would do, really do that? If it's with Harry, then yeah. You See, would do ooh. anything. Would you murder another human being if Harry Styles says, I'd fuck you? Yeah. Wow. Wow. What, what if he that's said, insane. okay, how about, would you Would you murder another human being if he said he would just give you a hug? Hug? That's it. <laughs> yeah. I'm hug. trying to find out your boundaries. Kiss. Okay, you get a kiss, but no tongue. Just a little, a quick peck. You got to murder a human being. No, you and have risk to, someone specific. You have to murder Kalila. No, I can't. Would you have sex? Well, if Carrie said, I'll have sex with you if you murder Kalila. This is good. <laughs> this is good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I have to. Oh, my God. You have God. to kill Kalila? <laughs> I think Kalila will understand. Yeah, yeah she would. But I fucking wouldn't. <laughs> and if, I would kill you. What would it take to, <laughs> if you said you had to kill Tito Bobby? What would you need in exchange for that? Just a hug. Just a hug. <laughs> <laughs> that was funny <laughs> and that was the right answer but that was wrong okay. hey dude this is a comedy show yeah, yeah I love alright she's right alright so he, Doc wait do you, so you know which one's which yeah okay uh, they will label one and two here okay, okay so he okay, knows okay. No, so Doc give it to Doc and let's have a little taste test and let's see which one he thinks is better but I also like the Food Network you yeah. gotta tell me why you know you when you watch Food Network they're like this is better and da 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 give me real reasoning to why you think this is better which one did you try first number one Okay, put the mic a little bit closer to you so we can hear. So what? Okay, so number, right, number one. one. Now, now give some descriptions about it. Nice, sweet, smooth taste to it. Mm-hmm. Okay. Is that number two now? That's number two. God damn, number two is beautiful. It's good, huh? Oh yeah. That that sound like that came. This feel like it came fresh out of the daily section. Mine came out of the container, so my shit been sitting up probably for about three, four days. Okay, okay. Which one? Which, which one? one is which better? one's better? One or two? Uh, number two. I will go with number which two. one was number two, Pete? Docs. That was the one oh, that you brought. Yeah. <laughs> so, so what? What's the proof of all this? You don't know shit. <laughs> you don't know yeah, shit. Yeah, yeah. Yours was frozen three times, <laughs> unfrozen, put back on a shelf. Yeah. This is why I call bullshit. And what all I that. still know, number I still know because I picked number two. No, no, no. You even said it wasn't yours. You literally went, "No, this ain't mine. This is my, nah, mine." Yeah, because I didn't even taste it. What? <laughs> it wasn't open. It was a brand new box. No, I know, but you you picked the one that wasn't your that was yours, thinking it wasn't going to be when you just t- tasted exactly, it. Exactly. But what I'm trying to tell you is he's doing is mind that tricks again. Yo, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> the Jedi fucking black mind tricks. <laughs> they work once in a while. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. You ever had the the black bombs do the three car molly on you? Same thing. All right, so uh, I know yeah. what. He, what he, yeah. Okay. yeah. Explain to me. Oh, Please explain. You sometimes, know what. sometimes in you know. In, in very heavy touristy areas. Yeah. There'll be a guy who has three cards, three card Molly, you know, three bent in half, and he'll do this. He'll show up and he'll go, which one's the, you know, and you have to pick, and then it's a trick. There's a, uh, it's a simple way of hiding a card that should be yours that isn't yours. It's a, it's a. But FYI, this kimchi. Yeah. Oh, I've had this. Whole is the foods. worst in the market. Oh, I've had this. <laughs> we have, Don't we have this in a home? That's a Whole it's Foods. It's not even open. No. Yeah, yeah. This is from Whole Foods? Yeah. yeah, yeah. Let me see. It's I've, the worst in the market. I've had this shit before. Yeah, it's terrible. Look at this. It says from Japan. Yeah, yeah. yeah that's why it's not good. Oh. Um, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, this is also... Well, okay. So these last week we talked about the ingredients. Yeah. You can't... Are these some of these ingredients not, not, not good for kimchi then? Cabbage, obviously. Yellow onion, green onion, red chili pepper flakes, Those salt, great. fresh peeled garlic, fresh ginger, organic sugar, fish sauce. The ginger, I don't think, is a thing. Is it not a thing for kimchi? I don't know. Why I don't am know. I asking you? You're not fucking Korean. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Ginger, fresh ginger. ginger, me. Organic yeah. sugar, fish salt, salted shrimp. Salted shrimp. Yeah. Ooh. Have you had kimchi before? No. I'm you want to try some? I'm allergic you, to shrimp. I'm no, no, no. There is no shrimp. shrimp in this. Oh. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. I want to try some. That's what I was going <laughs> to ask you. Yeah. If you had shrimp, would you die? Yeah, probably. Because it causes my throat to swell and shit like that. Is there shrimp in there? <laughs> Let's find out. <laughs> <laughs> On this episode of Is There Shrimp in There? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, for real, is shrimp in there? Because you can't fuck around. No, no. Honestly, m- most kimchi doesn't have shrimp in it. I think they're saying s- like a salted shrimp flavoring. You can look no, at it No, I can't. So here's how I'm going to explain it to you. 
One time I got <laughs> Why some... did I have to say all the ingredients? <laughs> yeah, yeah, but we nah, could have watched him. We, yeah, we, we could have watched him die. Alive, but, um, alive, but, alive, but, live on Bad Friends. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> but one but time well, I your throat would cheese. swell up, and then you would, your eyes would roll back, and no, you would throat, die. The throat closes. Whatever happens. Yeah, yeah. Well, let's see. Let me, no, when's the last time you had? So all shellfish. Not all of them. Well, yeah, yeah. Because I, I don't. So I don't know. I had every single one. So I've had lobster. No, can't do lobster. Can't do shrimp. Can't do uh, clams. Okay. Can't mussels? do crab. Can't do mussels. Uh-huh. All uh, of them. You could just say seafood. <laughs> you see all At this yeah, point, you well, named fish. everything. I can eat certain fish, though. Oh, certain fish. What, what are the fish you can't have? Like salmon can you have? Yeah. Tuna? Yeah. Okay. Like what, orange, what are the ones you can't orange have? Orange Ruffy, no. What? Orange Ruffy. <laughs> <laughs> It's, it's a, a kind of fish, but like the, the idea that you name, like, how often are you seeing orange fucking? I just got ruffy? sick off of it. I don't know what to tell you. Where did you try orange ruffy? It might have been a restaurant. You know what I'm saying? Uh, That's what orange ruffy. Oh, looks I see like. It's I actually mean. quite good. Yeah. Snapper. Catfish. You have, can you eat catfish? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Go ahead and say look it, at what a fucking look at what it looks like. Yeah. That, that's not kind of like me. It looks like one of my ancestors. I mean, if you were a fish, that would be you. That's where I came from yeah, for sure. Well, angry. Have any of y'all had a shark before? No, is is no. it is it legal? Like yeah, shark fin they soup? They sell it at Whole Foods. Shark? Yes. You could buy shark at Whole Foods. Yeah. What? Once in a while. Shark fin? I thought shark, shark like fin shark was meat? illegal. No. Nah. Have you tried monitors lizard? Holy shit. Here we go. <laughs> no, I know. We're going to the jungle. <laughs> We're going deep. <laughs> Wait, it continue. Go ahead yeah, and keep yeah. talking. So let me ask you something. All right. <laughs> Did you just say, have you ever tried? Monitor lizard. Yeah. Okay. What is that? It's like a really big lizard that there's. It's a lot in the Philippines, and they just make it their pets. Monitor lizard. Yeah. They make it their pets, but then you said, "Have you tried it?" So do they eat their pets? Yeah. Look at the fucking size of that thing. Look at that fucking thing. You eat that fucking thing? <laughs> <laughs> That's wow. like a Komodo dragon. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> what does it taste like? Oh, Let me guess. Yeah, yeah. Chicken. chicken. Yeah, they all taste like chicken. Yeah. It's good. So so, how do you cook it? You just grill it. Um, yeah, grill it or just fry it. That's what my uncle did. Well, let me ask you something. Oh, there's monitor food. You feed it, but then you eat it. I guess. Yeah, do you yeah. do you do you get it as a pet until you run out of food and then you have to eat it? Is that kind of how it works? I guess. Who can afford it as a pet? Obviously, someone that has a lot of money. <laughs> no, like anyone. They but, just. But then, find when do they it. decide if they're going to eat it or not? When they're hungry, I yeah. guess. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. What What is this? Abandang baywak. Bayawa. Yeah, that's that, that's what it looks like when you eat it. That's monitor lizard. Yeah. Wow, 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 wow. Let me tell you something. Zoom in on that. Yeah. That that's good. That does not look good. <laughs> that's the opposite of good. It looks good. Yeah. It does. I can't even I, see. I, 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 I can't even. I can't. There's not an American dish or any dish I've ever seen that go. Oh, it looks like that. Right. Yeah. <laughs> that looks like something out of this world. You have to try it. You know what that looks like? Yeah. If I clean out my my the compost thing under my sink, if stuff gets good, that's what it looks like. Yeah. It does. It looks like, right, right? Yeah. After that choppy thing in my sink when it gets clogged up, that's exactly what's underneath. Do you want me to bring that next oh, time? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. Or, you know, you know, you know, you go in the dryer and then you have that thing and all that. The lint? <laughs> the, the, the lint in there, yeah. They put some of that in there. <laughs> yeah, I mean, like... Are those poo seeds? I mean, what are, what's in there? That is that is not. Oh, and they left some skin on, so you eat some it's of the skin. Crispy, yeah. Oh, oh. it's crispy. <laughs> yucky, yeah. yucky, yucky, buddy. Yeah, I would fry it to the point where it was just like you could just only taste the charcoal and the darkness of it. <laughs> if I was on the show alone, then and that's only day eight. That's um, what really? What uh, if we were on alone and we're you and I were in the tundra and we haven't eaten eight days and we saw a monitor like, What's up? <laughs> well, I would eat it way before that. Uh, if right, I'm on a, day I'm four. On a, I did it day one if I could get it. <laughs> yeah, okay, in alone, that, one, sh that show. How day about one. this? I proposed it on this show before. Yeah. And I've said it again. And I'm going to say it again. Yeah. I want Fancy to reach out to Naked and Afraid. Yeah. And I want to do it with you. I would love. Will you do Naked and Afraid with me? We got We got to bring him. <laughs> I think there's only two people that are allowed. Okay, we'll get. We'll ask a three man. We got to do a three man. Will you please reach out to Naked and Afraid to see if we can do us three on Naked and Afraid? <laughs> Number one, I want to see him scared and naked. Oh, oh. Me too. <laughs> I don't want to be so on, bad. I'm not so trying bad. to be on fucking Naked and Afraid. Why? But, what he's going to ask you? Would y'all eat bugs? Yeah. Yeah, don't go from Naked and Afraid to bugs. Stop jumping around. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Let's talk about Naked and Afraid. Why wouldn't you want to be naked and afraid with us? <laughs> <laughs> I want to ask you. This is a weird scenario. I don't know what It's on television. You so know how what, famous you'll be? Who gives a fuck? They blur out the dick. Yeah, they, I don't care if you show the dick it. or not. It's just weird to just be out there naked with 
You two goddamn Our ancestors up. did this. <laughs> yeah. What's so weird about it? I think our ancestors like, okay. Okay, how about this? What, we, our ancestors what? What do you mean? Fucking more like a leaf dress, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You get something to cover up your penis. <laughs> yeah, to cover it up. Oh, okay. I and with, we, and like, with you, it's not a lot of I don't know. I guess it's my problem. I thought we was like rubbing like, cocks and eating A little pebble in it. You know what I'm saying? I can't hear you when you're talking over now. You got to... Yeah, go ahead. We got to doc. All right, I just said like... I just thought we'd be like rubbing cocks and eating monitors. You think that if we were on Naked Afraid, we'd be rubbing cocks to make fire? What the fuck are you talking about? Yeah, I got my own bow drill. Look at my dick. Insane. Insane. <laughs> oh, but just you and I then. Uh, yes. Okay. Okay. You and I. Will you propose that fancy? Will you please reach Absolutely. out to them? And also, yeah. I have I have a festival that I want us to go to. Show him the festival that I found today. A four day sex <laughs> island party. Okay. Mm. A sex island party in Las Vegas. Oh, what is it? You can have a hundred. It's like a hundred prostitutes per guy. <laughs> okay. First of all, number one, do we get um, passes from our, gr our girlfriends and wives? Well, we have to ask them. It's for the show. Oh, it's for show business. This is for the show. That's for show business. This is for the show. Right. I think I think it should. Have you, Doc, have you ever done that? No, no. I've never went to a brothel. But a have you had a brothel? A trap house. I've had sex in a trap house, yeah. A trap house? Yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah. Do you know what a trap no, house is? No. Trap house is like the drug house. It's like a... Yeah, yeah. You, so you've had sex at a trap house? I got blowjobs, yeah. Oh, you told us about that. Yeah, from, about from people that were on crack. There you go. <laughs> Yeah, I think that's worse than. But that's fine. But you didn't pay them; you gave them crap. Correct. I guess you paid them in a way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. They come. They come. New, normally, they come to you anyway. Yeah, they're there, and you're mm -hmm. like, you know, listen. Hey, baby, let me get a little bit of action for a little bit of. You know what I mean? And then you go, okay. You're <laughs> like, look, you got a mouth. I got some crack. Yeah, let's go on there to get a bit. And then when you're a kid, like, you know what I mean? You're ready to get them blowjobs. Sometimes. I would be so bad at selling crack. <laughs> Oh, you would be? Why, could you do it all? I would just give it away. I'd feel so bad when people are like, come on, man. <laughs> and I'd just be like, here, dude, get out of here. This is, you're scaring me. I was downtown with my friend Kalisto many, many years ago, and a crack addict goes, hey, man, can you spend some change? Mm -hmm. And I, I gave him 40 bucks. And then I remember my friend Kalisto grabbed me, and he goes, you piece of shit. And I go, why? And he goes, all he's going to fucking do is buy crack with that. Why'd you do that? And I go, because I didn't have any crack on me. Yeah. I mean, <laughs> yeah, I mean <laughs> what did you want me to do? Yeah, imagine if he asked for some change no. and I gave him crack instead. You know how happy he would be? He doesn't have to go to, you know what I mean? Yeah. I was, you know, there's no middleman. Right. At go that direct. Point, hey, man, you got some crack. You're like, I do. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Because they don't want so they don't want your money. Because they need to they get want your, crack. Because your money is another step. Yeah. Now I need to go get the crack. Yeah. There is that idea that like if you give homeless people money, they'll get liquor or some do something bad with it. So what? Yeah. But for me, it's like I just want them to be happy. I give them money all the time. Me too. I don't give a fuck. I don't give a fuck. Life's too short to me think about what they're gonna do with the money. Because they might buy crack, but they also might buy Jonas Brothers tickets to their not concert. There you, you go. You never know. Are or you yeah, they might go to Aspen. Or they might go to Dave Chappelle at the bowl and attack him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Imagine a guy's like, I'm yeah. just saving just enough money to run on stage, to buy a Dave Chappelle ticket <laughs> yeah. so I can run on stage. Are y'all serious? Y'all give to, to every homeless person? Not everyone, have? but every once oh. in a while, if I have some spare cash, I, I okay. might do it. If, I, if yeah. I have a little bit of money in my pocket, mm -hmm. You know what? You know what I do it the most when I leave the store? If I'm leaving the club and I'm going through Hollywood and there's somebody begging, yeah, I'm going to give it to them. Okay. Because wh why? you say it like you don't. You don't fucking believe in that shit? No, no, no. It's not that. I just don't. I thought you might meant like you run to the ATM, come back and bring them a little crisp. No, I don't. That's insane. That's Some insane. People. No, we don't do that. I'm not going to go to that. I'm not going to go out of my way. <laughs> well, you know, and if he dies really. in the meantime... Uh, <laughs> you know? although, no. although there was one incident when I was at the comedy store mm. and I was there during the day to pick up a check and I remember oh God, I, I'm going to name his name but um, he very funny comic mm -hmm. but he would relapse and he would always do crack oh. right and so he was there during the day just hanging out in the parking lot right and he came up to me and he was and he had scat he had a fucking lesion on his face like mm. something had busted open and a, a blood clot on his face it was fucking crazy mm -hmm. and he had no shoes and he's a really funny guy i was there that day too you were there yeah, you I remember that? A lot that day. oh yeah, yeah you yeah. know who it was don't say the name yeah, no I we're not, not. So yeah you, i know exactly you, you do talking. remember so i'm yeah, not making yeah. this up yeah no, he's not making it up yeah, yeah 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 and i go um i'll get you a hotel room instead okay because he asked for cash and i didn't want him to die from doing drugs right so i've twice that's happened in my life this my other friend louis same thing happened ck 
Sorry, <laughs> Louis. And he um he had relapsed, and I go, I'm, I'll get you a nice hotel for like three days, but I'm not gonna buy you, give you money, mm-hmm. because I don't want them to die. But I think the problem is, then you just gave them a place to do crack. <laughs> <laughs> You kind of just gave That's true. Through. That is true. I didn't think it through. I'm not getting you crack, but I'm going to get you a roof over your head to do crack. Yeah. <laughs> but I mean, in that situation, what do you do, though? No, dude, you didn't do... You, you, look. What do you do? You're, 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 you're damned if you do, you're damned if you don't. So yeah. you just have to do it and then hope that they make something that it works for them. Yeah. I had one of those moments the other day. I cried at like a fucking YouTube video because it was this... I think he had autism and he was like kind of finicky in a, in a guitar store and uh what she doesn't have autism at all i'm just but i mean he was very nervous and he just acted very like uh uncomfortable and he was trying to buy a guitar and it was two hundred dollars okay and the guy said uh, there was nothing funny about this by the way it was just sweet but, the guy, but, they, but here's, they, what, here's the challenge hold on, hold on the challenge is i want you to find the funny i know i'm gonna <laughs> you know i'm looking for that <laughs> as right. i say it here's the, here's the challenge no but as he the guy says he says, okay, how much is he? It's $200 with the guitar in the case. He goes, you don't know how long I've been looking for this. I mean, he was, dude, he was like, he needed it so bad. And the guy says, well, how much do you have? He said, I just got paid. So is there a way for me to put some on a card and some on a thing? And he says, yeah, yeah, yeah. So he lets him do is he 150 on this. And then he says he has 50 or something on that. And the guy's like, go oh, with taxes. It's like 220 or something like that. So he's short $20. Mm. And he goes, oh. And he keeps looking at his wallet. He's doing that thing. It's like almost like cartoonish. He keeps looking at his wallet like something might fall out. And then a woman goes, how much more do you need? And he goes, I'm putting it on layaway. They're going to put it on. They'll hold it for me for six weeks until I can muster up 20 more dollars. And she goes, I'll just pay for it. And it and it made me cry because I was like, this is faith in humanity restored. Now, the other part that they didn't show was that he had to fuck the shit out of this old pig for giving him $20. <laughs> There's the funny. <laughs> <laughs> no but he got but it, it was sweet it was so sweet honestly i'm being serious no was, I, that was really you know what that it was, was just really it just made me go oh. why didn't you you have money why didn't you jump in it was a video on you just <laughs> said, oh, 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 <laughs> upstart oh my god i've had um debt so problems debt. in my life yep and i i wish back then when i was younger upstart was around yeah it, it would have saved me you. it would help you yeah, they, yeah. Up, upstart is incredible they uh the upstart powered personal loans can help you pay down high interest debt all online with simple and easy to understand payment terms. They've helped over 1.8 million customers on their path to financial freedom. Whether it's paying off credit cards, consolidating high interest debt, or funding personal expenses, Upstart can help you get one. Fixed monthly payment with a clear payoff date. Upstart knows you're more than just your credit score. So rather than looking at your credit score alone, Upstart's model considers other factors like your income, employment, and other information provided in your loan application to find you a smarter rate for your loan. Check your rate in minutes for loans between $1,000 and $50,000 without impacting your credit score. That's huge. And you can even receive funds as fast as one business day after accepting your loan. So don't wait. Check your rate today at upstart.com slash badfriends. That's upstart.com slash badfriends to check your rate today. Don't forget to use our URL to let them know we sent you. Loan amounts will be determined based on your credit, income, and certain other information provided in your loan application go to upstart.com slash bad friends of course of course i would what, what? do you mean you wouldn't well, I would give him 20 dollars. you would not 200 dollar guitar ain't nothing for like 75 bucks or something like that fuck <laughs> out of here man there's people starving in africa go on, go on with that guy oh are guy. you helping people starving in africa <laughs> that saying, phrase well, yeah, yeah. how much money though. have you sent to africa doc i haven't sent a goddamn dollar. well they <laughs> shut the fuck up <laughs> <yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just saying, I'm not giving a dude twenty dollars for it. Look at that, that says that an acoustic guitar. guitar is four hundred dollars. What are you talking about? Well, whatever the case is, I'm not giving for a guitar. That's that's a luxury. Yeah. Okay, I, you know what? I hope that guy writes a song uh-huh. about how much he doesn't like you. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Speaking of the saddest thing I've seen on YouTube, can I tell you the saddest video I've seen on YouTube? Mm-hmm. I don't want to see the whole thing. Let's not play it. But it's this Cambodian TV show. I'm already crying. Cambodia does it for me every time. <laughs> <laughs> and it's a reunion show when people were ripped apart by the Khmer Rouge and, and the war. Mm-hmm. Okay. And so they reunite people, right? And um, a woman gets reunited with her sister, right? Mm-hmm. And they hadn't seen each other since they were kids, right? Which makes you cry. Immediately. Right? But then there's a third surprise. And I, I don't want to ruin it for people. Don't ruin it. Yeah, yeah. But there's a third surprise. And once you see the third surprise, 
bro. That's it. If you don't cry, turn, you're, yeah. Turn on the waterworks. Y- yeah, yeah. Oh. It's really good. It's really good. What's the name of the show so people can look it up? Uh, uh, Gook Family. <laughs> 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 I don't know what it's called. It's know. Cambodian show where sisters get yeah, reunited. Yeah, you just put Cambodian reunited, and that's the first video. We, we could actually fast forward it to the end. Yeah, that's it. Can we just fast forward it to the end and to get to the surprise? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, so I'll just give it away. Fuck it. All right? <laughs> I'll just give it away. Fuck it, right? Yeah, just so, yeah, roll it in the background. Yeah, so, yeah so the two sisters get reunited, and then the lady goes... Well, here's a family photo. And the the both both sisters like, wait a second, that is us as kids, but we haven't seen this photo in 40 years. So where'd you get the photo? They found the mom. Shut up. That's the photo right there. Yeah, that's the photo right there. They found the... (laughs) Hey, man, you can't hit me with surprises, man. You got to fucking slow that shit down. Right, right. They already already did the reunion. That's the reunion. So go back. No, no, no. Leave it. Do the reveal. Do the reveal first. Go back. Go back. Go back. Yeah, that, okay, so now she's going, they haven't revealed it yet. Don't be scared, act normal. Yeah, yeah. That's the mom. Right? So, um, wow. yeah. She's scared. And why do the kids get lost? Is it be, they gave up the kids for... No, they they got split during the war. There's bombs oh going on. Ah, people running. God. Hey, turn it up now a little bit. Turn it up. It's a rough language, isn't it? It's so unattractive. I was just thinking the exact <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. same thing. There's no way to be romantic it's with like that. It's like the opposite of French. Uh, come here, baby. <laughs> you know what I mean? It's like so hard to... <laughs> hey, Gary. Oh. She kind of doesn't believe it's her. She's like, who? who is this? Yeah. It could be anybody. I mean, <laughs> Asians, <laughs> they all... <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> She's like, you look Chinese. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it could have been Sandro in a way. It, 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 it doesn't matter. So now watch. Here's the third. Nothing can compare to this. Well, just what, you what, wait. Well, yeah. Push pause. It would have been a great though if right before their embrace, Bob just dies. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> or just a heart implodes and she dies. I mean, how? That would have been. <laughs> She's like, mong duck duck. <laughs> duck duck. <laughs> Doc is You're right, it, it Doc? hit him hard. Oh, man, that shit made man water up like a <laughs> man. God damn. Well, God bless, Doc. God man, bless man, you. Man, that's some special shit. Doc. How do you feel about that, Rudy? <laughs> um, it was sweet. Doesn't give a shit. She does not <laughs> give a fuck. You're Remember, I showed, tried to show you this video a couple years ago, and you didn't even watch it. No. Yeah, she doesn't like it. Why? You don't like to feel, huh? <laughs> I like to feel sometimes. What do you like to feel? Harry Styles. Harry. No, what do you feel? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. This isn't it. You don't. This doesn't get you. I think this comes with age. I think you can't appreciate this stuff till you're older. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Then once you get older, you've you never can't. Se- you've never felt loss. No. Yeah, yeah. And when you feel lost, and and that, and I think when that happens, you'll start those feelings will. I don't know, maybe. No, you're right. I don't know. When you go through some sort of trauma or loss, there's something that happens when you see stuff like that. It makes you get emotional because you know what it felt like. You know what the that all those emotions are. You don't have any fucking emotions. No. Yeah, we gotta buy. We gotta get you some emotion. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I don't know. She's a special one. Well, the worst part is like if she did, like you know, if she killed Kalila for to bone Harry Styles, like she'd be even happier about death. So it'd be it'd be working in reverse. Yeah. It's like she's never gonna get back to a good place. Yeah. You're gone forever, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ. Yeah, yeah. That doesn't do anything to you though. That really watching that doesn't even it was nice. Oh what do you mean? It's nice. God. Nice to look at? Yeah. Like, I like their dresses. Like when they hug. <laughs> oh. That was But you didn't cry. What? Yeah. No. Right. Her response is why? Why would I cry? Yeah. <laughs> what would make her cry about that? Yeah, thing? what would make you cry, do you think? Dogs. Oh. oh. So if two dogs. Rook, rook, right? Yeah. And here's your mom dog. Rook. Do dog re- do, <laughs> do dog they start, yeah. and they start licking each other and then she's dog fucking reunited. like yeah, yeah. do dog reunited yeah, yeah. reunited just write dog reunited this is gonna get you yeah. this will get you I don't think it will you ice cold bitch yeah, I don't think it will <laughs> oh my god the dog look at that with its owner oh they don't really know that woman that well oh lick a face oh he huh? just start the red rocket comes out Look at that, Rudy. Oh. No, the, the saddest one 
is, is a, army sol- whenever the, the, it's soldiers. What, what, when the dog, there's one where a dog is literally crying at his master's gravesite. Mm. Oh yeah. 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 And you can he, he's going. <laughs> Oh you know yeah, I mean? like and doing he's huffing that. and puffing. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. I remember that. It's husky, right? It's a husky. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh no, that, that, that. this. No. If this doesn't get you, yeah, you're <laughs> you're a, a, you're a narcissist. Okay? Piece yeah, of yeah, shit. Well, yeah, yeah. You're a piece of shit. <gasps> Holy fuck! This is killing. <laughs> this is actually killing me. Shit! Why would they put that one right after? Yeah, because it, when another dog is gone, they can't believe it. Oh, no. Okay, uh, 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 see, now, there, it is, there it is, there it is. See? Oh, this is dying owner. Oh, man. Hey, man. This is going to turn into like a uh, your mom's house where, they, <laughs> where we watch this fucked up shit. No, 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 no. I can't uh, see this. Okay, stuff. Okay, stop turning off, man. <laughs> oh, no, man. Fuck, the bro. They get worse and worse. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> The next one is like a dog wearing a wetsuit <laughs> diving in to save six other dogs. Jesus yeah. Christ! Whoever put that together, yeah, has no gate. Who has no gauge of how extremism works? <laughs> <laughs> They're like, oh, there's a dog crying on its um, on the, uh, the old owner's grave, and then four dogs in the street that were bludgeoned by cars <laughs> pawing at each other's face. It's just that was a little yeah. too much. Too much. Too much. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Way too much. Yeah. Let me ask you this: okay. Is there a movie that you cried on? Oh, I cried. Oh, I cried shit. a million I cry movies. movies all the time. All man. the time. What, okay, give me two. I'll, I'll, I'll give you one scene one, okay. that makes me cry every time. The last second of the movie Magnolia. Uh, what's at the end there? So John C. Riley is dating this girl. This girl was molested by her dad in mm. the movie, right? The talk show, like he was. I like, remember the movie. Yeah, talk show host or whatever. Yeah. And he's, you know, going. I want to be with you, and we're gonna do all these things, and it's just a fucking camera shot on the girl's face, and she's lo- looking at him with tears in her eyes, right? And the last second, she looks in the camera and she smiles. It's so fucking good. Oof. It makes me. It's like redemption. Oh. It's like feeling safe. I felt it when you said it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. What makes you cry then, Doc? Do you have something in your mind? Shit, Gladiator. When the motherfucking, when she's like holding him and he's dying, and then mm. she's like, go to him. And they show his family, and then his wife is like, her hand go across the thistles. Right there, that hand across the thistles. That's it. Hmm. Motherfucking tears. <laughs> I'm in that motherfucker bullhorn. As the I cry music. Every song, time the I music. Watch that part. What did you just say, Fancy? As the music. The music. The music, yeah. The music. Fuck. It's yeah. like, God yeah. damn. What about you, Jules? What, what have you cried on? It's the dog movie, Hot Chico. Air Bud. <laughs> I do get it every time I see Air Bud. Yeah. I start fucking Not Air up. Bud. <laughs> Hot Chico. What? Hot Chico. Hot Chico? Yeah. Yeah. C H I. It's an anime. Is it a fucking no, anime? No, it's not anime. <laughs> I've never heard of Hachiko the movie in my entire fucking life. That's the movie. What is this? Who's in there? Wow. Richard fucking Gear? <laughs> <laughs> Richard Gear? Does he jam the fucking dog in his asshole? <laughs> <laughs> Bring up the trailer. <laughs> that would make me cry too. <laughs> that would, oh, that hurts. Do you even know what he's at? What he's joking about? No. Yeah. It's oh, a, it's an urban me. legend. I don't think it's tr- not true. <laughs> But there's always been this herbal legend, and I don't know why I, I came from, where Richard Gere stuck a gerbil in his asshole. What's a gerbil? It's like a little mouse. A little hamster. Why? I don't know why. What? What is that urban? How did that even come about? That urban legend. Oh, oh yeah. At the ER. The ER. What? The show? That what? he went to the emergency room and they had to get it out of him. That's really? Where the, that's where yeah. the rumor comes from. Oh wow. Hey, who knows? How See much. if it's true though. Is it true? How could you? They're not going to fucking. They'll have that removed. R- highly questionable cultural history of Richard Gere's ass gerbil. <laughs> <laughs> the article doesn't help me not know. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's, it, it, it's called gerbling. Yeah. That's what it's called when you do when you put gerbils in your butthole. It, oh. ger- gerbling. <laughs> gerbling. Yeah, and you got to leave little pieces of food up there for it to find. Oh. It's animal cruelty, right? For some people. No, but the animal dies, right? There's no animal that goes in there. I bet it there. comes out alive. Really? If it, I mean, if, if I, I stuck you in an elephant's asshole, <laughs> for how long? For more than fifteen seconds, you'd be dead. If I could get <laughs> a little bit of air, I'd be okay. It, I mean, yeah. some people would say eating monitor lizards is bad. You see what I'm saying? 
Yeah. yeah it's but... fine. It's normal. See, and so gerbling might be normal in some cultures. Some people might be have been, gerbling might have been the way that they found God. Uh, I don't want to question someone's religious. Yeah, you know. But is is the sensation? Let's just explore it a little bit. Um, is the <laughs> sensation? I would think is to feel something die inside you. Ask oh Doc. My God. Well, fuck. You <laughs> gerbil. No, no. 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 old dog. Uh, Maybe a little hamster or something. Just see that little t that little patter of the feet. And anybody <laughs> out there that likes to make art for the show, like. And by the way, I want to say uh, Carrillo Studios. We love this guy. This dude makes such great art. Anybody that likes to make art for the show. Go ahead and make a uh, gerbling doc, no. if you could, please. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You yeah, don't yeah, want yeah, that yeah, out there yeah, in the yeah, yeah. Please, please, please. We love gerbling doc. <laughs> yeah. So go back real quick to this movie. I need to see. Oh, that does Carrillo Art Studios. That's our guy that, that makes great art for us. We love this dude. Go ahead and say it your way, Fancy, because, you know. Eric Carrillo. Yeah, enough. Okay. <laughs> you let him do that once, and because he, he's like, can, can I do it live on the show? I'm like, yeah. Are we going to Hachiko? Academy, I want to see the trailer for Hachiko. Yeah, trailer for Hachiko. It's from the director of Chocolat did this fucking movie. Wow. It said based on a true story, too. Did is this it? Yeah. This is just a story about a guy who fucking adopted a dog and it works out? Yeah, but at the end, something happens. The, the dog, dog dies. dies. No. <laughs> Richard dies. Gere dies. Yeah, and then the dog waited for him at the train station. Oh, shit. But he didn't know because he didn't know he was dead? <laughs> he got Doc. <laughs> he got oh, Doc again. He got God. Doc again. <laughs> Keep going. Let's see. Keep They're talking. not going to show anything about him dying. Yeah, though. yeah, yeah. See, he's always waiting. Yeah. All oh, right. Pause it. Really irresponsible to let this dog just roam around town. Do you know what I mean? He can get hit with a, by a car so easily. Yeah. <laughs> and why is my dog waiting for me at the train station? Because he had to go six miles to get here, Richard yeah. Gere. Yeah. That was fucking mean. Let him roam around this small uh, town. Here's another thing. Just if you thought about this. Remember the Cambodian video I showed you earlier? With the, what if yeah. they were in town? <laughs> There'd be no hot chico. <laughs> Wait, that same that same shot. <laughs> Dude, that same shot of, of 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 him looking under that clock where the dog's supposed to be, and it's just those three women like. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Dude, you were fucking cracking me up right now, dude. Bro Dude, you're cracking me up right now, dude. You know why? Why? Because can, can I, I saw this video. It's on YouTube where the dog goes <laughs> and he's his owner dies and he just goes to the same spot and just waits. Oh, yeah, and I see that. Is that yeah. the same video? Oh. Yeah, that's the same. That's got to be what they're talking about. Oh. We just now, watched it. That became real. Yeah, it is on YouTube. We just saw yeah. it. Yeah. Now. What if, you mean the real story? Yeah. Yeah. Well, where the fuck is the real one? That's got to be better than this one. Let me yeah, tell you something. Like, oh, yeah, go ahead. That didn't get me. Yeah. I just, that didn't get me. Not like the Cambodian woman story. Oh, no. Ha, ta, there it is. That's, give me the fucking real one. Give me the real. Let me see a photo of this, the faithful pup. <laughs> oh, 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 and they, oh, first of all, it was an Asian guy. Yeah, it was and an Asian they, story, so I, you're wrong. No, no, no. I'm talking about there is a real live, like, United States thing that happened. I know, but it's not that movie. It's not based on that movie. But I felt it, Bob. Okay, it's fine, it's fine. So wait a minute. This whole film was based on an Asian family and their dog, and they fucking whitewashed this movie. They whitewashed it, yeah. Another version of the fucking white devil. It's like Ghost in the Shell when they put fucking Scarlett Johansson. Same fucking Ghost thing, in the yeah. Shell, right? Yeah, they fucking Ghost in the Shell. You can name so samurai. many movies they've done last this. Last goddamn samurai. She was white. The fucking motherfuckers. Yeah. You can name so many. Ghostbusters. What? Ghostbusters, That yeah. was an Asian they film. They were all Asians. Ghostbuster. Yeah. Da -da 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 -da. Ghostbuster. <laughs> da -da 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 -da. <laughs> yeah. If there's something scary, oh. and you don't know why. Oh no, Shrimer. Shrimer. Yeah. <laughs> Everybody know. Ghostbuster. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Shit, yeah. <laughs> yeah, it was. Like... <laughs> and and Slimer. Yeah. Shrimer. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> I put a, a green on you. Green on you. <laughs> the ghosts are all yellow. <laughs> I am with a key master. <laughs> oh my Insane. God. Insane. I'm sick of white people fucking stealing <laughs> Asian films. And I'm we got to put a stop to it. It's disgusting. <sighs> well, I mean, I, I, told you, I told you about, you know, because I have a joke about it on stage about um, they made a movie about Genghis Khan. Oh, yeah. And John Wayne played him. I know. I know. That picture John we Wayne played Genghis Khan in a fucking movie. You know who what? Genghis Khan is, don't you? Yeah. Do you know who that is, Rudy? No. Uh. Look at that. John Wayne is Genghis Khan. He was the Joe Stalin of uh, China. 
Look at that. Look at that. Did you say he was the Joe Biden of China? No, Joe Stalin of China. Oh, I was like, what the <laughs> fuck? <laughs> what a weird... <laughs> Joe. You know, he was a Joe Biden of Chinese yeah, 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 yeah. back then. He was a Kamala Harris of China. <laughs> <laughs> Zoom in on how insane that is. This is insane. That's John Wayne. Yeah. <laughs> As an Asian guy. Do That's what they used to do. By the Holy way, shit. doesn't look Asian even a little bit. At all. Not, even, not at all. That just looks like a guy who likes motorcycles. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's just a fucking... But uh, imagine imagine the calls that the wow. Asian actors that auditioned for that part got when they found out oh, who got it. Shit. Who? who? <laughs> 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 what? Look at the guy to his right, how they've uh, gussied him yeah. up. That is crazy, crazy shit. Crazy, dude. Oh that's a white God. guy, too. Yeah, that's a white guy. Yeah, yeah. They're all white. Yeah, yeah. Oh. <laughs> they used to do that. Go to the IMDB page, and I want to see the cast, and let's see actually how many fucking Asians Asian are members there. are on the yeah. cast. Yeah, what's that movie called? The Conqueror. It's, the Conqueror. it's called The Conqueror. Yeah, yeah The yeah, Conqueror. Called, that's right. Conqueror, yeah. Okay. 1956? 1956, yeah. Okay, scroll down. Scroll down. By the way, the love interest, also a white girl. Yeah. Oh my Stars, God. here we go. Zoom in deep. John Wayne. Susan Hayward, Pedro, <laughs> Pedro. <laughs> so Latin dudes got it before. Yeah. Agnes Moorhead, Thomas Gomez, and as, uh, as Wang, Wang Con, he did a great job though. <laughs> yeah, he was John dead Hoyt, on. William Conrad, Ted DeCourcy. So wait a minute, this it, anything? It's oh, there's a Lee Van Cleef. <laughs> as Could he be? As Chepe. Oh, yeah, yeah. At the bottom, oh. Richard Liu, the there's captain it. of Wang's guard. <laughs> oh, he, he, yeah, background. <laughs> yeah, yeah. What? That's the only Asian we only found Asian. on yeah. the primary oh, cast. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's a billion Chinese, <laughs> <laughs> and they can only find one. That's crazy. There's That's a billion crazy. of these fucking people, yeah, 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 yeah. and they're like, we just don't know where to turn. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I just don't think we can cast any Asians in this. Yeah, it's insane. Wow, Richard Liu. Shout out to fucking Richard Liu. You know what? Yeah. This episode we're dedicating to Richard, Richard Liu. Richard Liu. Shout out to Richard Liu, born in one of your favorite places in Hawaii. Died the year of our Lord Andrew Santino's birth, yeah, 1983, yeah. here in Los Angeles. What else did Richard Liu do? I bet you some more racist shit. Yeah. <laughs> the man with the golden gun, steel helmet, the quiet American, purple heart. Let's see his names though. This has always got to be. Go, yeah, scroll down to his actor. Let's see the name of all. It's always got to be. What if he did a movie called <laughs> Emperor Hirohito and Steve Martin played it? Emperor Hirohito. <laughs> <laughs> and he's just a guardsman. Look at all of his names Cam, Cam Chung, <laughs> Chen Li. Dr. Li Pu, yeah. Chang, Chang Kai-shek, yeah. High Fat, Tanaka, Y.S. Chen, yeah. Lin Chu Tai, Shen Shi, <laughs> Leo. My favorite is when it's just like Mark. But yeah, yeah, yeah. Jimmy McGavin or something. Like, yeah, right. Let me ask you something. This is, that's what's bullshit about it is, is that mm. not like, because mm. he's born in Hawaii. You know what I mean? So he's an American guy, right? Yeah, he's an American guy. And system. imagine that's all he could get. Yeah. Those are his thing. Chang Chang. Yeah, ping pong. Ping pong. You know I mean? <laughs> and he's like, and that's once every five years, probably there's one part as a guardsman or some butler. Well, even on, he looked, no, no, right there. Hawaii 5 0, stop. Hawaii 5 0, 1968. Wong 2. Yeah. Wong 2. Yeah. And you know those writers are doing that because they think that something's funny. You know what I mean? The writers are like, Wing Wang or uh, yeah. Wang Chung. Or they just take pe pots and pans and just throw it against the wall. Hey, and I dream, <laughs> look at this. In I Dream a Genie, he was yeah. just Wong. <laughs> just Wong. It? Yeah. <laughs> hey, can I be Wong too? No, just Wong. <laughs> well, here's a question. Yeah. Do does do Korea make remake American movies? No. They don't? No, no. Korean does a lot of original stuff. We do original oh. stuff. Yeah, oh, yeah. Okay. okay. Well, you, you think that Korea is going to make... Uh, let, let me sit there... I have an idea. Go on with the Let's win. do Malcolm X, biopic, <laughs> all Korean cast. By the way, <laughs> I'm, I'm, going, I'm watching that in the theater. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and there's Malcolm X, Bobby Marie. <laughs> <laughs> you know what it should be? What? It should be, uh, <laughs> what's the Denzel movie? King Kong ain't got shit on me. Trading Day. Trading, yeah. Trading Day. Yeah. Yeah. Training Day Training Korean day. style would be so funny. Yeah. <laughs> but they would set it, they would rewrite it, right? But they would never do a biopic, right? I don't think, they would, you because know, Seven Samurai, the movie Seven Samurai, America made it into Magnificent Seven, which is okay because they they set Samurai into Cowboy and they they same storyline, but they switched the character. That's one thing. That's right? cool. You could do that. But I guess. If, if you're casting, you know what I mean, a white dude to play an Asian guy, that's where I have the problem. It's just goofball shit. It's goofball. Yeah. Especially yeah, a historic problem. figure, not like. <laughs> it's not like just a random dude. 
It's uh, fucking Genghis, Genghis Khan. Khan. Yeah, it's weird to play Khan. a big figure, and it's it's weird on all fronts. But yeah. also, shout out one more time to our main guy. What was his name again here? Richard Liu. <laughs> you please memorize it. Richard Liu, Richard Liu, Richard, Richard Liu. Shout out to Richard Liu. Rest in peace. Thank you for coming to the cookout, by the way, and I'm appreciative of you guys bringing food. What Scare. is this again? This is potatoes and eggs. Potatoes and eggs? Yes. That doesn't sound yeah, good. Yeah, I don't know right now. Uh, a pass? Wait, I, I got... Well, and, and what is this? Is homemade? Yes. Wait, who made who this? Made it? I made it. You oh, did? He made, well, I gotta try it. Oh, it actually smells really I'll good. <laughs> you want to try one of these? Yeah, potatoes okay. and eggs? Really good. This is really it good. Goes warm for breakfast. Oh my I would god! Kill it. Wait, what's mm. this called? Tortilla. No, it's not a fucking tortilla. Don't do that. It's shit. Spanish, not Mexican. Rude. That's rude. <laughs> that is rude. You're calling Mexicans lazy because yeah. they don't do that with their tortilla. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, this is called tortilla. Yeah. Wow, this is good. really good. Give some. Thank to you for being a bad friend. Give some to Doc. Oh, thank you for being yeah. a bad friend. That's where the punch is. It's at the government. Hey, that's where my finger's being pointed. It's, it's at not, the mm, fucking mm, government. I never said that it was this color. This color. I'm saying well, the that this is happening it's white to people. us because it's white people. of the it's white system. People. It's white people. The, most, white people. the most uneducated guy on earth. Yeah, the guy who really, knows literally I know a lot. nothing. I know a lot. The guy who knows like literally that. nothing. Yeah, I know about critical race <laughs> theory and everything. You know about critical race theory? You're so fucking dumb. listen to me.